Hey there, it's Tanya's Anybody's Sarah Co. and I'm here to do the May new releases. I'm just a smidgen late, and by like a smidgen late, it's like a week late, but it's totally cool. It's worth it, I promise. We have washi and finals and tons of jumbo deco, two kits. You know what? Well, let's just get into it. So let's start with, I guess we'll just start at the top. Um, let's see. The first things we have are the new vinyls. We have this Molly Loves Mermaids. As you can see, there's an aerial right in the middle, but I understand that she only has six sisters because there's seven C's, but I needed eight mermaids for my boxes, so I'm just I just went with it. And I really, really like how it turned out. They all have a little different hair and they all have the same tail but different colors, and I just thought it was so dang cute. Next up is, I think it, I named this one Molly Gets Abducted or something like that. This is just the glitter vinyl that goes with the space kit. And in my head, <laughs> this wasn't going to be as shiny as um, I it turned out. Like this purple is way shinier than I thought, but it's really, really pretty. It makes the cow really pop. And then we have Molly Misses Her Friend. And if you look closely, the clouds, the wings... And little footprints are in glitter. Just, I wanted something a little ethereal because this sticker represents something extremely sad. And at least it can maybe bring you a little joy with the sparkles. Oof, that was depressing. We shouldn't have done that one for the third one. And then Molly, this is the bloomer you're planted. Okay, again, this is another one in my head. This was much cuter. Each of the, the petals are a different color, but then they're glitter. So like... The hollow, it's a lot, but I really like it. And I think it'll add like a little pizzazz to your planner, but yeah, definitely. <laughs> it's a little sparklier than I anticipated, but you know, you don't get like a proof to know how it's going to turn out. So in my head, very, very cute. In, in actuality, still cute, but not as cute. Then we have eight Molly sheets. This is the Molly Loves Tropical Leaves. I wasn't going to do this one originally. I wasn't going to do jumbo deco or deco sheets for it because it matches the wash. And I was like, let's just do it. And I love how they turned out. And then you have Molly Loves Lemons. Molly Loves Pool Floaties. This one matches a kid. And you'll probably recognize this from one of the freebies from TPC like a year plus ago. But I finally turned it into a kit and it's very cute. I think it's very cute. You, I hope you guys like it. Molly loves mermaids. These are the ones that match the kit as well because we have a mermaid kit. Like, because the aerial kit wasn't enough, we just needed more mermaids. But this one is all like her sisters. And if you notice, there's not actually a Molly in this sheet, which is crazy. Molly loves the claw machine. So I needed something to mark when I go to Dave and Buster's with my husband because you guys, I love Dave and Buster's. And, you know, funny enough, we do play the claw machine. Never win. I don't think we've ever won at the claw machine, but we do play it. I think I should do like an arcade game or something. I don't know, but I liked it. I thought it was cute. It could kind of be like if you're at a bowling alley and you play a game, anything like that. I just, maybe a carnival even. Molly loves daycare. This one was a request and it turned out so cute. She's like supervising all the teeny tiny kittens. Oh, so cute. And they have like a little toys. I don't know. I'm about this one. Kind of makes me wish I had a tiny human in daycare. Molly loves grading papers. This one's very cute. So she's all like, these are A plus papers. There's not, nobody got less than an A plus. Like good job, A plus. Molly's not about that life. So yeah, if you're grading papers and you're happy, that's, she's that. Well, even if you're not, maybe you need a happy Molly because you're not having a good time, but she's happy to be grading papers and giving everybody really good marks. And then Molly loves audiobooks. She's just sitting in her chair, listening to her book. Maybe she's playing some solitaire. Maybe she's playing some base 10. I don't really know what she's up to, but she's definitely enjoying a book of some kind. I would guess based off what I know about Molly, it's probably something bird related, but who's to say? Anyway, those are the actual sheets for the month. Just eight, nothing crazy, but I really, I kind of feel like I, I went above and beyond for the jumbo deco. So we have Molly Love Lemons, Molly Love Lemons, Molly Loves Lemons, it matches the washi, and I know a lot of people are using smaller planners. Sorry, I just ate lunch and I have a little bit of a hiccupy kind of thing. So using like smaller planners and like I did this one for my cruise. This was a gift from Chris, but this was like using Molly Deco and then some washi and I love how it turned out. So I was kind of finally getting on board with this Jumbo Deco thing and I was like, okay, let's do Jumbo Deco to match washi if I'm able. So we have the lemons, then we have the leaves and as you can see, this is more of a 
kind of a yellowy green. I was going to fix it where it was more greeny green, but I kind of like how it looks, so I left it alone. Then we have the pool floaties. I like this one. The colors are so, so pretty. And then we have the mermaids, which, I mean, they're very cute, so fun, right? And I kind of was thinking this one could be really cute with the part of your world washi from many a moon ago, but it's kind of the same vibes. I think it's cute. So yeah, you can kind of do whatever you want, but there you go. Love the jumbo deco. So that's four jumbo decos this month, which I'm pretty happy about. I feel really rusty filming. Like I don't feel like I have it together, but that's okay. Next up are the kit. Well, the hobo kits. We have the Molly Loves Pool Floaties. I love the color palette. You'll see what I did in the bigger kit, it's easier to see, but I'm, I I laid it out. It's very cute. And then the Molly Loves Mermaids. This color palette is my jam. This purpley pink color, oof, chef's kiss. It is so good. I love it. It feels more summery than I thought it would when I started picking the colors, but also a lot like super bright summery. I don't know. I just, I feel like it's a fun color palette. And then on to the actual kit. So let me show you what I did with this float kit. So it is a pool background as you can see. So you have the full boxes and it's um, just, it's very blue. And then I thought, okay, let's pull blue into the kit. And I wasn't feeling it. And then I ended up with this like citrusy color palette. So then I got a little, I had to think about it. I was like, all right, this seems a little strange, right? With all the blue, but I was like, let's see what I can do. And then I came up with the idea to do the date covers and the washi with the blue. So now you have blue at the top, you have blue in the middle with the full boxes, and blue at the bottom with the bottom washi, and then these citrusy colors, it looks so cute laid out, which clearly I didn't actually bring that to show you, but I assure you it's very cute. And then we have the add-on sheet. I love it. I'm so happy with it. It's so cute. Then we have the mermaid kit. Okay. So I was originally going to do one mermaid per box, but I was like, this isn't as dynamic as I want. And I wanted something like really, I want it to be really like funky, right? Because everybody's doing mermaid kits. And then I was like, but I also like functional boxes. So we did the best-ish of both worlds. So we have deco boxes, we have functional boxes, but not entirely functional. So like if you are not one of those people that likes to ride in them, they're cute enough on their own. And I love the colors. Oh, I just, I love them. And then these are the date covers. They're the same date covers from the Little Mermaid one, but I just changed the colors around. I just, oh, I like it. And then the add-on sheet with the Currently Reading sticker. Did I do a Currently Reading sticker on this one? Did I? Oh, gosh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Did I? Let's see. No. Oh, I'm going to have to fix that then. Sorry, guys. I will fix that one. Um, and I'll have to update the listing. So good thing I went to look at that. I guess I used an old, I open old kits that I've already designed to use the format to design the next one and I opened the wrong one. So yeah, that's an easy fix, no big deal. And then we haven't had these in a while, but we have oopsie bags. So I thought I would show you a quick example of an oopsie bag. So $10, you get 10, 10 items, I guess is a better way to put it because I have a couple bags that have washi in them. Um, but let's just say 10, 10 sheets of stickers, but it could be product testing. It could be stickers there. Like I said, there's one of them. There's some washi in them. I think it's, I think there's eight bags with some random washi. Um, and then you get some other stuff that's not tied to the 10. So let me just show you what you get. So you'll get some sort of card this one, I will admit that all of these have this one thing in common because I have so many of them left. If you guys remember, I was in the TPC Black Friday something something. It didn't sell. And instead of paying us out like I thought, she just sent them all back. I had a bunch of these. So one sheet, two sheet, three sheet. So already, you know, you have a little, like a full kit basically. Then you have four. Five, six, seven. Then you have some Molly's. You have eight, nine. And then this is a product test. This is a Molly metal washi card. Um, I think there's a space one running around. There's a sticker one running around. Like I said, there's a little aerial one. And then also you get these two, two little vinyls. You get a sampler and you get some other random vinyl. So that's $10, which I think is a pretty good deal. Um, if you're into mysteries, definitely check them out. Pretty sure all of them 
have most of them anyway have the washi card of some variety some have actual washi rolls some of them have more hobo kits some have less hobo kits some of them have more mollies it's just kind of whatever there's 24 up for grabs right now though i think i just sold a couple so 21 um coupons cannot be used on those because they're already heavily discounted and most of them aren't even oopsies they're just like overstock or I had too many of something that I wanted to reformat or you know something along the lines and then we have washi we have four washi rolls this month we have the lemons I love this one. Oh, it's so cute it's so summery it's so bright it's so happy and then here's it laid out on white so you can really see it so cute Oh, so happy with that one. Then we have Molly Loves Light Blue. This is continuing the Molly color palette, which there's, I feel bad for the people that really liked it because it's not, we're not going to finish it. We're going to mostly-ish finish it and then that'll be fine. And then we have Molly Loves Clouds. This is the sky colorway as opposed to the colorful colorway. It's a very cute. I like this one better, actually. I feel like it'll be easier to pull in. So cute. And then last but not least, which is my current favorite of the collection, is the Molly Loves Leaves. Oh, I love it. It's so stinking cute. Oh, she's like, oh, she's so cute. And then it looks so good with the deco. And I hope you guys really, really like it. So here you can see with the lemon, so good. And with the leaves, oh, so good. So anyway, I hope you guys like it. I love if you gave this video a thumbs up. If you decide to come join the Indie Beauty Secret Co. family, that'd be amazing. Hit that subscribe button. I haven't designed the freebies yet, so I don't have them to show you, but they are mermaid themed. So if you know what this mermaid kit looks like, you like color wise, you can kind of, you know, expect that. Anyway, thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.